So Joe Bond reports live. I am here in a place called Patchy Wallop, which is in North Western Victoria. Yet again, I'm here for the Silo Art Trail. Now I need to just tell you that a, a Brisbane artist called Finton McGee booked a room at the local pub to immerse himself in the community to get to know the people. And when he met local sheep and grain farmer, Nick Noodle Holland, McGee knew he had found his muse. The muse is now replicated on the silo here in Patchy Wallop. Okay, according to Holland, the local bloke, the rugged, lanky local exemplified the no-nonsense, hard-working spirit of the region. Perhaps more importantly, importantly though, Noodle had just the right height, leanness to neatly fit onto the narrow 35 metre high canvas twin 1939 grain corp silos. Completed in 2016, the artist's depiction of the famously reserved Helens portrays an image of the architectural Aussie farmer. Faded in blue flanny. Yep. Flannelette shirt and all. Blue denim jeans, as you can see. All right. He had sun bleached hair, squinting gaze to speak the harshness of the environment and the challenges of life in the Wimmera Mali area. Okay, the artist was born in Lismore and he was influenced from a young age. He immigrated from Northern Ireland. Jeez, really? Anyway, long story short, this was done in about 2016, I think. Anyway, how good is the Patchy Wallach silo here? in Western Victoria. Jobon and the dog. Jabber Travels reports live.